Hello, back again. I'm just going to show you how to add shortcuts to your desktop of your favorite channels when running a TV head end server. Right, first thing we need to do is download a playlist and use the IP address of your TV head end server. So, this is my IP address plus the rest of the text. I'm just going to uh, select it all, right click and copy. I'll just minimize that. I'm going to open my browser and just paste it in. And it will download a M3U file. I'm just going to save it. Only takes a couple of seconds to download. Just going to minimize that and go into my downloads. So this is my M3U file. Just going to open Notepad and drag it across. So these are all the channels my TV head end server picks up. So I've got uh, BBC One, BBC Two, ITV, Channel Four, Channel Five. It also picks up uh, your radio channels as well if you want to make shortcuts to them as well. So there's all my channels. I'll just scroll back up again. What's thing I'm going to do is open another notepad. I'm just going to do the main five channels. So I'm going to do BBC One first. So I'm just going to copy the, uh, the first line and the second line for BBC One. Just right click and then copy and I'm just going to paste it into notepad. Now I'm going to go file, I'm going to save as, I'm going to save it to my desktop. You want to change save as type to all files and the file name I'm going to go BBC uh, BBC One, then dot M3U. Make sure it says M3U at the end. Then I'm going to click Save. So that's the first one saved to my desktop. I'm just going to delete this one. Now I'm going to do uh, BBC Two. So I want the first line of BBC Two and the line below. I'm going to select all that. I'm going to right click, copy, paste it into Notepad. Do the same again, file, save as, change to all files. I'm going to name it uh, BBC2. dot m3u and save to me dos uh, desktop again just delete this again I'll uh, speed through the next couple I'm just doing exactly the same. They're all being saved to my desktop. Last one. Paste it in. File. Save as. All files. Oh, I'm going to change the name to channel 5. M3U and click save. Right, I'm going to close that down because I've uh, done the ones I want to do. I'll just close that down. You can add others if you want to. I'm just going to close that down. Close that window. Right now I've got the uh, 
links to my channels on my desktop. So I've got BBC One, BBC Two, ITV, Channel Four, and Channel Five. I'm just going to test them to make sure they work properly. I'm using a uh, Media Player Classic, but uh, VLC Sorry, works honey. as well. That's a uh, BBC One. Just make it full screen. Uh, BBC Two. Ravi. <laughs> yes, Mum. What's the What's the deal? Ask him to eat uh, the vegetable called drumstick. That's aphrodisiac. <laughs> He's not trying to shag the pet. Uh, ITV. Your husband's missed a couple of payments. Channel 4. Empress, this is men's things. Your gift came and I could not wait to give it to you. And Channel 5. Each group will learn who they're they all working all right. Oh, oh. Oh, wow. There you go. Fancy. Just close that down. Right, so they're all working. thing I'll show you now is if you want to add the icons, we'll say the channel icons to each one. So thing we need to do, open a browser and go to uh, mediaportal.com website. If I scroll down, you've got to download for channel icons. So I'm going to download UK logos. Only takes a couple of seconds to download. I can put me my uh, downloads. And that's done. Just close my browser. Going to go into my downloads. And I'm going to unzip the folder and extract to just going to go into the first one and glossy so I've got radio and TV so these are all my channel icons for UK TV so I want BBC I'm just going to move it to my pictures and I want uh, BBC 2 Just move it to my pictures. Uh, where's ITV? I'll just search for it. ITV. And I want uh, that one. Just going to move it to my pictures again. Now I want channel 4. Just move it across. And last one, channel five. Just move it across. Just gonna go back. And go into my pictures, where I moved them to. So I've got BBC, 2, 4, ITV, and Channel 5. The thing you'll notice, they're PNG files. The thing is, we need icon files. So I've made a little batch file to uh, convert them. So I'm just going to click on my little batch file. And it's converted them from PNG to icon files, which we need. I'll just uh, group them so you can see the different files. Right, just going to minimize that. Right, the thing is, we need to move these 
M3U files to a different folder. The thing is, I'm going to put them in C and create a new folder. I'm going to click on C, I'm going to right click, create new folder. I'll just call it TV. I'm just going to go back to my desktop. We need to move these now to that folder. So I'm going to select them all. I'm going to right click. Make sure you cut them because we don't want to leave them behind. We don't want to copy them. We want to cut them. So I'm going to go back into C. Into the folder I just created, TV. And paste them in. thing I'm going to do now is create shortcuts to them back on the desktop. First one, second one, uh, one more, last one done. Right, just close that down. Now we've got shortcuts to the M, uh, M3U files. So the thing we're going to do now is add the icons. So I'm going to go into properties, right click on them and go into properties. And down the bottom you'll see change icon. So you just want to browse. My icons are in my, uh, my pictures. So I want a BBC one and just click OK then apply it's the first one done the same again properties I'll just move it to the center change icon browse BBC 2 ok and then apply and then ok again same again for all your channels change icon browse or ITV. OK. Apply. And then OK again. Just do the last two. It takes a couple of seconds to do. Er, channel 4. Last one. Apply, then OK. So that's all the uh, icons added now. The thing I'll do, I'll just test them to make sure everything's still working. So that's uh, BBC One. I was born in Saint Charles, Quebec, Canada, on the 26th of July, 19. BBC Two. Dogs, she's great, and uh, Dog Father actually gave me a nice message. When that happened, he actually said, um, Are you alright? And I said, Yeah, not too bad. But, um, <laughs> oh, that sounds like a heartwarming <laughs> conversation. <laughs> that sounds... That's really touching. Well, Nicola is very persuasive. ITV. The night time is the right time, I kid you not. <laughs> We've been here before, I know you. Channel 4. Were you staring at me? No, ma'am. You were. Like you wanted me. No, no, I was... I will walk on. And do not even think of... Last one, Channel 5. I feel very comfortable surrounded by animals and the farm lifestyle. It has stayed somewhere deep in my heart from my childhood. So that's uh, everything set up with your shortcuts and your icons. So as always, uh, I hope this video's helped and uh, goodbye.